the Malawi operation, which commenced in July 1991, was Dr. Creek's brainchild, and probably one of his biggest operations and achievements to date. Successfully importing 95 roan and 65 sable antelope from an African country has never been done before. Experienced and diligent as he is, the negotiations and planning took more than three years before this one-of-a-kind importing operation could materialize. Yuan Creek flew up on the 10th June 1991 to start building BOMAS, set up camp and finalize logistics. Five 30-ton trucks were used to transport all the equipment, Lucerne vehicles and building materials to Malawi. The game capture took place in two very remote areas, with the distance between the furthest camps being over 850 kilometers. Two quarantine stations were built 400 kilometers apart. A Jet Ranger helicopter had to be used to cope with a high altitude of over 8,000 feet above sea level, especially with the own capture at Nika. Around 104 hours flying time was recorded for this capture, and without this machine, it would have been an impossible operation. A very experienced pilot was vital, and Dirk Albers, with over 8,000 hours, was instrumental in this success. Along with Dr. Crick together, they have darted over a thousand animals between 1986 and 1991. Animals were darted from the helicopter, and over 80% of the Rhone were cargo slung to more accessible areas for transport. Given the terrain, this was an integral part of the successful capture of the 95 Rhone in the Nika National Park. During the operation, seven vets were employed to continuously monitor animals during loading and every kilometer of their transit. A veterinarian was present at every BOMA as well. The rest of the team consisted of a mechanic, helicopter pilot, full-time cameraman, a team of local Malawian laborers, and a team of South African laborers. The late Dr. Dirk Nietling, best friend and colleague of Dr. Crick, assisted during the whole operation and his contribution and positive attitude was a great support and comfort for Dr. Crick during the three months in Malawi. More than 140,000 rand worth of medicine and drugs were used. Animals were kept in BOMAS for between three to four months and regular blood samples were taken and sent to Onostapurt for testing. All animals were tested and the green light given by Onostapurt at the end of October. Early in November of 91, the big export started with five Hercules C-130 flights at around 80,000 Rand per flight from Lewandi and Mizuzu to a quarantine station in Petersburg. Animals were kept under for 11 to 12 hours during which animals were darted, loaded and transported to the airport, customs cleared and flown to Petersburg for three hours. The last blood samples were taken and sent to Onderstapoort and the animals were microchipped before they could be sold. Early in December, buyers started collecting the animals from the quarantine station in Petersburg, where Dr. Creek darted and loaded the selected animals into their trucks. After these animals were sold, Dr. Crick moved the remaining 24 roan and 24 sable to his farm in Kimberley, where he started breeding and started Matanu Private Game Reserve. At a cost of around 2 million rand in 1991, this operation had to be successful and animals had to be sold for the correct market prices to ensure the viability of such an operation. The operation was thought to be the biggest operation in Africa, but after assessment and logistical analysis, it is now regarded as the largest and most successful wildlife importation operation ever undertaken by a private individual in the world. With a survival rate of over 90.6% throughout the capture, 
five to six months period in pens. In the words of Dr. Crick, whilst being interviewed after his animals safely arrived just before Christmas of 91, six months after the first animals were darted, all praise and thanks be to God, without whom none of this would be possible. A big thanks to every person who helped and assisted in some way to make this operation a huge success and start me in the wildlife industry. Dr. Crick named his farm Matanu, a Hebrew word meaning gift from above. 